first question, how does it feel to be sitting here today as a draft pick at the NHL draft? It's almost surreal. You can't really put words to it. You, uh, you wake up yesterday dreaming for this moment, and you, you think about it ever since you're a little kid, just waiting to put on an NHL jersey, and uh, couldn't, couldn't be happier that I'm going to Arizona. Can you walk us through the last 24, 48 hours of your life? What's it been like? Um, obviously a little bit stressful. You, it's a little bit nerve-wracking in those stands, but once you get your name called, it's surreal. You have you, a uh, big smile on your face. You can't control it, so you just got to enjoy it. Who's here with you? Uh, I got uncles, uh, obviously my whole family, my brothers. I couldn't. Um, my family, my brothers, my mom, my dad, so I got a lot of people here with me. Oh, yeah, so um, I think their smile was just as big as mine, so they, they are so happy for me. They come from different places? To, to yeah, absolutely. I got a couple uncles from Toronto, one from Ohio in here, and then obviously my whole family from Waterloo is here as well. What would you say are your strengths as a hockey player? Um, I think the way I can read the game. Uh, I grew up around the game watching my two older brothers, and I think the way that I can become a two-way centerman and really be on the defensive side of the puck is one of my main strengths. Specific areas of focus last season for you, things that you were trying to take to another level? Um, I think obviously my offensive upside. I think that's definitely something that I try to work on. I, want, I have a strong defensive game, obviously being on the right side of the puck, but um, working on that one time and making myself a power play guy and being more versatile in all the situations and trying to create offense for our team and being that guy that's looked to on their team, I think that was one of the main things that I worked on. Which, which skills go into that in, in your mind, the things that you needed to work on to, to create more offense? Um, I think m one of my main goals was my shot. Um, spent a lot of time after practice working on my one-timer and my snapshot and everything that, that I needed to work on, but also just wanting the puck. I really wanted to play with the puck, take hits, create space for my line mates and myself to be able to create offense. Um, hopefully a big off season. Go back to Waterloo and enjoy it and uh, keep working hard. Make sure that um, get bigger, stronger. Obviously, I want to fill into my frame a little bit, um, but enjoy the off season and get ready for next season. Is there an NHL player that you look up to and try to mold your game around? Um, I try to mold my game after a Mark Shifley. Um, it's kind of like Skinner Belt, like I am built into his body coming out of junior. So I think I can kind of follow his path. Obviously, talk about that offensive upside that I think I would have. So um, hopefully, continue that and uh, become an elite centerman in the NHL. You and Mackenzie and Cameron are linked now. Uh, Do you guys have a history before? 20 minutes ago? Uh, not really, no. I kind of knew Mackenzie from playing against them, but um, two great guys. I uh, met them a little bit earlier, and absolutely amazing guys. Met Cameron at the Combine, so great picks also. Mm -hmm.